Hello, School Rumble fans. It's been a long time. Uh, this is Mo with Jen Kobayashi Hear Me, a.k.a. the Justice for Harma campaign. Uh, it's been quite a while. Um, a lot of things have changed in my personal life, and I haven't been able to make videos for quite a long time. Um, it's been over a year, I believe. Um, and it's been about that long since we've heard anything from Jin Kobayashi, you know, from School Rumble. We received a few special chapters, and I was glad to, you know, see those. I was very grateful to, to, for us, you know, for Jin Kobayashi to release those. Um, and our sources told us that, um, you know, 2018 was supposed to be a year that he released something. Um, of course, we were thinking more along the lines of, of, you know, new manga, not just special chapters, you know. I've had a lot of time to think about things about, you know, maybe why he hasn't released anything else since then. And one of the things that I've considered which I really hope is not the case, is that maybe he, you know, was aware. I, I believe that he was aware of the Justice for Harama movement, you know, the Jin Kobayashi Hear Me YouTube channel and page and all of the fans and all of you who have supported me, so many people. I think that it obviously must have gotten the attention of Mr. Kobayashi. And so maybe he released those special chapters to see if School Rumble was still getting the amount of, of popularity, the amount of buzz that it used to get. Maybe he released those chapters to test the waters, so to speak, and to see if it would be worth it for him to release new School Rumble manga, serialized manga not just special chapters, and maybe eventually uh, new anime. Um, and maybe, I really hope not, but maybe he wasn't satisfied with the amount of attention that the special chapters got. Maybe it wasn't enough for him to think it would be worth it for him to bring School Rumble back Maybe it didn't get enough attention by anime fans and, you know, by the media. I don't know, you know. I think that it, it's definitely a possibility. And uh, I really hate that if that is the case. Of course, you know, I'm, I haven't given up. You know, I'm still searching for new School Rumble information all the time. Um, I don't have internet right now, so it's very hard for me to update and to, uh, you know, upload new videos. And of course, there really hasn't been much to talk about. It's been kind of very quiet as far as Jin Kobayashi and as far as School Rumble. Um, there's really been silence. I haven't been able to find any new information in uh, in over a year. Now understand, I, I really hope this is not the case. I hope that he hasn't seen, you know, the attention that the special chapters got and wasn't satisfied with the amount of attention that they got and decided to stop. I really hope that's not the case. It's very it's very disappointing if, if that is the case. And so many of you out there have supported, you know, Justice for Harma and the Jen Kobayashi Hear Me movement. Uh, there's so many fans that still want to see this completed in, in, in a in a good way, you know, with Justice for Harma, you know. I really hope 
if Mr. Kobayashi sees this and understands it or maybe can get someone to translate it to Japanese for him, I really hope that if he w were to see this, that he would understand that School Rumble still very, very much holds a high place in the hearts of, of so many people. I talk to people from from so many different countries, you know, uh, and they all want the same thing. You know, they might not have the same ship, you know, but they all want the same thing. They want some kind of closure for Harama and for the other characters, you know. They want a good ending. They want they want more school rumble. There's a lot more story that can be told, you know. And when the story is you know, is done being told, we just want a good ending, you know, especially for Harama, but not just Harama, all the other characters also, you know. We we love those characters. All of those characters are so well written, even the side characters in School Rumble. You know, there's no manga or anime really out there, even to this day, that is comparable or as good as School Rumble in that sense. You know, all of the characters, you know, you're interested in all of the characters. You, you become invested in the characters you know, to a degree that, you know, you're not really able to in most anime. Uh, don't get me wrong, anime and manga, you know, I, I love them, you know, but there's nothing really out there that is at that level that School Rumble is. It, it's very unique. Um, I've gotten a lot of new subscribers I've gotten a lot of messages and comments on my videos. I haven't been able to answer any of them, unfortunately. I'm very sorry about that. Um, I just, I haven't had internet access except for my phone, and my phone is very slow. Uh, I moved to a different location, a different part of the country, and uh, I've been here for some time now, but uh, it's been kind of hard uh, adjusting and getting things situated. I still do not have home internet. The only internet access I have is my phone. And like I said, I can't do videos on it. And uh, it's very slow. So please, everyone, if you're still here with me, and I know that many of you are, uh, please bear with me. And, um, you know, please continue to send me messages on the Facebook page, you know, and continue to comment on the YouTube channel. I will try my best to get around to answering everyone's questions and responding to everyone's comments and, uh, you know, just getting, trying to get back into the Justice for Horror movement uh, at a more full-time pace. So thank you all, everyone. You're all so very supportive. Uh, and, you know, I, I, I really miss... Uh, updating and making new videos and talking with everyone so just uh, you know just stay tuned and uh, you know in the meantime as I always say justice for Harama closure for the fans may the hero get his girl and may his spring finally come